Hello guys, it's me Carl Santos, aka Happy Car Life 5, and I'm gonna do a new game. And it's a racing game, so it is F1 2021. So I thought I wasn't gonna do Formula One anymore, but I decided I come back right back and do it again, so so basically this is story mode and not part of career mode to be honest with you. And it's called Breaking Point, so uh, as the title says, it's basically like a reality show for those that want to get up and compete with the big boys of F1, but for me, I'm not good at it, so I put it in easy and normal mode, because I don't know how to get into a rhythm when it comes to getting around a F1 race course, so... so I thought I was gonna do the put the prologue in you know the Abu Dhabi race that I was doing which took place in the 2019 F2 season but the thing is it's just my Xbox DVR video files got corrupted and well this is how we end up with chapter one you know and and also what you'll see is Chapter 2 and Chapter 3 got corrupted, so it'll skip to Chapter 4, which is the British Grand Prix in Silverstone, so you'll get an extra bonus chapter for looking up this video. And, you know, I come from an NASCAR background, but yeah, I wish they, that NASCAR did this kind of story-based mode. Where you are a rising upcoming driver and then you actually do a hot seat offer and I think seven or four games did a good job in that department, but they just have to be creative like F one, you know. So So bas that's basically it that I know about this breaking point story mode thingy. <laughs> so I'm like Capricorn on that five. Y'all have a great day and peace out. As they climb out of the car, the Red Bull team are ready and waiting to celebrate a thoroughly well-deserved win. Well, what's happened there to Kasper Ackerman? Still managed to finish, but that's got to be frustrating out. Yeah, it looks like maybe it was a gearbox fault, which is always a blow for the driver. Ackerman won't be happy, but I'd say he's done very well in the circumstances. Well, this isn't the start he would have wanted after last season. Let's hope things pick up for him. The drivers are en route to the podium as we speak. What a fantastic win for the Red Bull team. They performed exceptionally today, keeping us firmly on the edge of our seats throughout the entirety of the race. Congratulations to every one of the team. out there today. Let's talk about it. 
So not a great race out there for you today, Casper. Can you talk us through what happened? I don't want to go into details. I'm angry. I'm really angry. I was ready to push it today, to have all that preparation and focus wasted by a vehicle fault. I'm, I'm almost lost for words. Well, despite obvious vehicle difficulty, you still managed to finish. How hard is it to bring it over the line when facing such issues? Well, this is where experience comes in. You just have to switch off, be mindful, but try and ignore what is going on around you. To concentrate only on the problem at hand and hope for the best. While it's an unfortunate start to this season, last season was muddied by a tense relationship with your teammate. How are things now with you and Aidan? That was last season. It's no secret that Aiden and I had a few run-ins. But that's the risk when you put two drivers together for the first time. I don't like to look back, only forward. I'm sure he's learned a lot and we'll see what happens this season. Thank you for your time. So we're coming to the end of my YouTube video right now, so give a thumbs up button if you like the video so much, click on that bell button to subscribe for more content, and if you saw the recent video interesting, share the comment right below the description so you can share some thoughts and feelings with everybody in the community and make them feel welcome. So I make a happy Corona 95, you all have a great day and peace out.